Hey babes, so today we are keeping it kind of simple and as usual I'm starting off with my Frankie Rose Cosmetics Primer applying that all over my face then I'm going in with Peaks Cosmetics 10 color concealer palette and I'm using that shade right here and this is just going to cover up those dark circles underneath my eyes. I do have a coupon code if you would like to purchase this palette and you will get 10% off. So I'm just blending that out right now just because my dark circles are pretty bad right now. And then I am going in with my Frankie Rose Cosmetics Foundation and applying that all over my face. I did get a little tan so this is kind of off right now my face is looking a little bit more pale than the rest of my body but this is going to fix it it is the fit me powder in 220 and this usually kind of evens it out just so my face doesn't look so white compared to my body then I'm going in with my Kat Von D color correcting primer and applying that on my lids I'm not applying as much as I usually do only because I'm only going to use some a subtle color and this is the 28 color eyeshadow palette from Peak Cosmetics as well and I'm using this peachy tan shade this one's pretty pigmented and I love the subtle shimmer that it has on so I'm doing piece by piece I don't want to just glob it all on at once and taking it into my crease and then I'm going to apply some on a fluffy brush and then add that to the outer corner and then use the remainder going towards the inner corner and this is just going to give a subtle eyeshadow look I don't want it dramatic I want more of a subtle look today then I'm going in with my gimme brow brow gel and this is from benefit cosmetics and I'm applying that on my eyebrows and then I'm going to go in with this other gel from Benefit Cosmetics, the Gimme Brow Brow Gel. And just cleaning everything up, making the lines smooth, neat, clean, and perfect. And as you can see, it looks very simple, but adds the right amount of detail. So now I'm going with my NYX Cosmetics Matte Liquid Liner and this time I'm only going to apply it to the center of my lids and then going out. So I'm not going to the inner corner like I normally do. Once complete, I am taking my Frankie Rose Mascara and applying that on my lashes right before I get to my falsies. And I'm applying these falsies. I completely blanked out on the name, but I'll have them linked in the description box below. These aren't as dramatic as my normal lashes. And I just love how they look. They go perfect with the amount of eyeshadow I have on and the amount of eyeliner I have on. So it doesn't look too dramatic. Now I'm taking my Peak Cosmetics 10 Color Glamorous Blush Palette. This reminds me a lot of my BH Cosmetics Palette. And this one, the colors are very pigmented so you do have to be very careful. I am taking the bronzer in the palette and applying that. And then I'm going in with this peachy pink color and applying that on top. And like I said, you have to be very careful because they are really pigmented. And for my lips, this is the Peak Cosmetics Duet Dual Liquid Matte Lipstick. One side is the matte liquid lipstick and that other side, that clear white side that you saw, that is the glossy side. So it can go from matte to glossy, which I think is pretty cool. And the color does not transfer. And this is in the color Cherry Twist. I love it. I think it is the perfect shade of red, not too bright and not too dark. So now, because I want the glossy look, I'm going to apply the gloss over that. And it's currently on sale for 40% off if you use my link in the video description below. And just look how pouty they look. I love the color and the gloss just adds that extra pout. 
Now to get started with something quick, I'm taking my hair down and I'm using my Duval Naughty Hair Detangling Brush. This actually currently comes with a hair straightener, so you can get it for free. This is just going to help detangle my hair. Then I'm going to separate it into sections because now we're going to get started on straightening my hair. I'm taking my Duval Impulse Hair Straightener. This actually has five different heat settings. So I believe there's 270, 320, 410, and 470, and another one. I'm missing another one. But I'm setting it to 410, and this is just going to help me get that pin straight hair, which is what I want. And it's actually just going to take about two to three passes to straighten this hair. That way, I don't have to take so long straightening. So I'm just sectioning everything. And this straightener is actually $185, but if you use code PINUP70, you can get it for 70% off. And it comes out to $55.50, I believe. And like I said, right now, it's currently coming with the Naughty Tangling Brush. So that's kind of a mini little score. And I don't think you need explanation as to how to straighten hair. <laughs> I think everyone kind of has that down. So once I'm done, I'm just kind of breaking up the sections so it doesn't look choppy. And then I'm fixing any imperfections that I see that I want fixed. And this is how my hair looks. It looks so shiny and straight. I also did forget to mention that that 70% off code works for all of their styling tools. So now moving on to outfit, I have this cute t-shirt. It is my Not Today Satan shirt. This is from Vixen by Michelin Pitt. You can't see the Satan. I had to roll the shirt up just because it fit big. This is a size small, so the small fit pretty big on me. And I paired them with these vintage gal clothing high-waisted black shorts. I have these black shorts in uh, jean color as well, so blue. And I just love the way they fit. They're the only shorts that have been able to fit me perfect on the waist and at the hips. I was so excited when I found these, so I had to have them. And they do button up from the back and they zip. So there's a zipper in the back and a button in the back. And I know a lot of people kind of put the button in the front, but that's not how it goes. <laughs> and then I paired them with these red flats. So this is the outfit all together. And as you can see, I mean, I just love the way those shorts fit me. They just fit perfect. But that is my look for today. I hope you all enjoyed it. This is my semi-casual look. And I will see you dolls soon. Bye, loves.